Back to you, Mr Balecki. If their warrant was issued at 9.40 a.m., why didn't you phone the AWU until, my information is you phoned at approximately 4.25. Why didn't you phone till then? Uh, Senator Kitchen, can I just um, go back to an answer I gave you previously when I said that not all notices to produce had been uh, fulfilled by the AWU? Um, that's not correct. I got confused with a different registered organisation. So um, I withdraw that answer. Um, in relation to your question, I defer to Mr. Enright. Uh, thank you, Senator. The, uh, uh, the, so just so we're clear, just Mr. Walecki, you've withdrawn that answer. So there is full compliance. And again, and Mr. Enright has said he won't answer this. Why did you not use a notice to produce when the AWU has always complied with every notice to produce that has been served upon it? Why did you decide on a raid? As Mr Enright has said, uh, we're not going to discuss that no. further. Okay. Sorry, Mr Enright, you were saying um, about why you didn't phone the AWU. It took you oh, yes. a full working day to phone the AWU. S yes, thank you, Senator. Um, an operational decision was made uh, to contact the AWU. Um, to try and facilitate a respectful, professional um, search of the premises, and uh, I made that decision to contact prior to um, any attendance by uh, the rock staff or the Australian Federal Police, and I made that decision okay, to do that you. at 420. Yep. So I wonder, I don't, you were here, you were sitting at the table, I think, when I read out section 409, uh, sorry, um, 419 of the Criminal Code Act to Senator Cash, which is about hindering or obstructing a public official. Would you, now that you know that Senator Cash's um, advisor has resigned and in fact did hinder and obstruct your inquiries and your work, would you, will you now pursue action against that person? It's not a matter for me, Senator. Well, who's it a matter for there, Mr Enright? Is it's that Mr Balecki? Mr. Certainly Balecki, not a matter for the registered... Well, the registered organisation doesn't have jurisdiction to investigate... You've got... You've got you can make a complaint. The registered organisation... You can organisation... make a complaint to the AFP, in fact. I know they're overworked but you can make a complaint to them. The registered organisation doesn't have uh, jurisdiction um, to investigate any, any matter that's remotely... No, no, no. What I'm suggesting to you is that you could make a complaint to the AFP and the AFP will decide whether there is enough evidence that Senator Cash's advisor did obstruct your inquiries. I would suggest that you would want to do something like that because didn't you say, Mr Enright, that you were... What was it? most disappointed, the most disappointed person in Australia that your raid had been interfered with? That's wouldn't true. you be wouldn't you be wanting Kimberly. wouldn't you be wanting Kimberly. to complain to the AFP? Well what I said Senator is that uh, there was nobody in Australia more disappointed uh, than me. It's not not I didn't use the word interference. I said I'm, that's Chair, it. I'm just so Mr Balecki, can I can I just can, 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 can I just 